Hi, thanks for joining me, Steve Hayes from the Connected Technology Business Unit within Element. SAR and Power Density are two services that Element provides around the globe. From our bases in the US, from Europe and in Asia, we offer SAR and Power Density measurements. So what is SAR and Power Density and why do we do it? Fundamentally, if you make a transmitting device that is on or close to the human body, we need to make sure that the amount of energy absorbed by your body tissue is kept to a minimum. Specific absorption rate is that measurement itself. We simulate human tissue, we have probes that go into that tissue and we operate your product and measure the associated energy that has been transferred to that tissue itself. Specific absorption rate or SAR testing is typically done up to about 6 gigahertz. Above 6 gigahertz, however, the same principles can't be applied to those measurement techniques. And we move then from a SAR measurement into a power density measurement. How intense the energy is to make sure that there's no very localized heating effects. So power density measurements, same principles, slightly different technique, a go and we perform those measurements from six gigahertz and above, particularly relevant to emerging technologies such as millimeter wave as we see in the new types of 5G cellular equipment, um, 60 gigahertz bands which are increasingly uh, used, ultra wide band techniques, all using much, much higher frequencies than typically used by radio communication services. So Element offers a range of SAR and power density measurements covering the whole frequency range. And for those frequency ranges that we can't take physical measurements because of limitations of test equipment, we also supplement that with doing mathematical simulations and modeling. Specifically at the low frequency is what I'm thinking about, which is another service that Element offers. If that's something you're interested in, feel free to go to our website at element.com to get further information. Thanks for listening.